Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you five unique things to do in Budapest, the capital city of Hungary, and why this is my favorite winter destination in Europe. Number one, take the tram along the River Danube. Budapest is a city full of history. Popping on tram number two is the warmest and cheapest way of sightseeing in Budapest in winter. It goes along the riverbank, taking you to many iconic landmarks in Budapest, from the Parliament to Chain Bridge, from Buda Hill to Castle District. The yellow tram itself looks very cute and retro. Number two, take an evening river cruise. The Danube River delineates Budapest into Buda and Pest. The river is wide and peaceful, linked by many beautiful bridges. It's especially romantic after dark, with all the lights lit up on both sides of the river. The best way to enjoy the night view of the river is to take a river cruise. From the boat, you will get the best view of the Parliament building too. It's truly a magical experience. On a winter evening, it can be cold sitting on the deck for an hour. But don't worry, the staff on the cruise will give you blanket if you decide to stay outside. Number 3. Go ice skating in City Park City Park is in the center of the city on the Pest side, an oasis at the heart of Budapest. It's a vast green space with many attractions. In the summer, locals come to take a boat ride in the lake to relax. In winter, the lake is transformed to a huge ice rink. It's truly a fairy tale like ice rink with the castle of Vadahonyad and the hot air balloon as the backdrop. It's allegedly the largest ice rink in Europe, the size of 8 Olympic sized ice rinks. Skating here is the tradition of the locals with over 150 years history. Here is where kids have their first lesson, where teenagers hang out with friends, and where the senior ice dancers show off their skills. Number 4. Walk across the chain bridge The chain bridge spans River Danube between Buda and Pest. It was the first bridge across the Danube in Hungary. The bridge was opened in 1849 after the Hungarian Revolution and was one of the largest in the world at that time. Fun fact, the Hungarian Count Istvan Zegini visited England to get ideas of bridge designs, and he in particular admired Hammersmith Bridge over the River Thames in London. The engineer of Hammersmith Bridge was hired to design and build the chain bridge in Budapest. It's a really nice walk across the bridge, and you can capture some nice selfies. Number 5. Visit Fisherman's Bastion once you walk across the chain bridge to the Buddha side, you are then very close to Fisherman's Bastion. It's an amazing group of architectures built between 1895 and 1902 to celebrate the 1000th birthday of Hungarian state. They're designed to be medieval style for this purpose. The Matthias church next to it was also redesigned. From here, you can not only get the best panoramic view of the Budapest city, but also get some wonderful photo shoots. It's free to visit and enjoy the city view, and it only costs a few euros to enter the tower if you wish. Last but not least, Budapest is the most affordable European cities I've ever visited so far. A 24-hour transportation card costs 7 euros, a French-style brunch at a boutique cafe costs 10 euros, you can easily find super nice hotel right in the center with 5 minutes walk to the river around 50 euros per night. I spent two very happy days in Budapest in early February and I recommend everyone add it to your travel list.